How you going, guys? That's Groody, Groody Swiss from yesterday. <sighs> right, thought I'd show you something I've been playing with for a while. Um, this one, the clearances are a little, little loose compared to what they should be or what I would want them to be. This is my mechanical locker for 188mm diffs, so um, E30, E28, E36, E32, E34 medium case. Right. So it's just a geared locker. Put enough pressure on one side and it will open, open its teeth. This one is a... you can see it. This one's a cheaper locker, so I can do these ones for about, I think, by the time I buy the locker, I modify it, because we've got a, we still use a press-in pin, but there's a few mods, there's a little shim to go on this side, I need, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. hold on, clean the screen, I need a pin as a exchange. So I'll send out a modified pin and a fully modified locker. These will fit 188mm. Like I said, non-circlet. I'm not doing a circlet one at this point in time. But unmodified case. Oh, only mods I did do was I opened this a tad on one side just to make it easy to fit. So yeah. They are quite aggressive. It will open wheel, but it needs a lot of loading on the on the one axle for it to open wheel. This is a Chinese one, so these I can supply for around the $600 mark. If you want a good quality one like a, an Aussie Locker or a Spartan, they are about $740 or $750 by the time I do the modifications I've got to do. There's a few, fair few hours I've been playing with it to make it work. Um, haven't worked out how much difference there is in offsets at the moment for shims but I'm happy to fit this to a diff for somebody for a small fitting fee. They can send me their, their center and I'll fit one and I'll send it back and it can go straight back in your car. So yeah. This is what I've been working on for ages. I have a company actually making them so they'll fit straight in but we're about three years in that project. So I decided version 1 is what's in the Red Rally car, this is version 2. So the difference with these versus everything else is this here. This is your sun gear. Now the little locator actually isn't a locator. These locate on your axle. In a BMW diff. Here we go. Here's one we prepared earlier. So the issue that we've got is this is, this doesn't actually sit in that groove and locate. It's just a guide. Alright, so most of them have got the same width. Most of these 188s all run from here to under there, all run the same width. So my setup will just go straight into there. Some of these have got a bigger width here than others, but yes. Um, the Spartan or the Aussie Lock is actually open here and these little, let's get our pointer so my fat finger's not in the way, these little spring mounted locators actually sit further in like here. So with this one I've had to modify a few things, I've had to machine the sides, I've had to make spaces, I've had to cut stuff down. It works. So yeah, version 2 is now, now available, so if people want one of these, you know the drill, get onto me on social media. I will, probably in the next week or so, I'll purchase some stock. I've got to go see one of my suppliers and see what he's going to charge me and go from there. Alright, thanks guys. I hope you have a lovely day and uh, I'll look forward to actually doing some for sale posts in the next week.